Every day, some special U.S. Customs officers are on the lookout for illegal items in travelers' luggage. But this isn't just a story about explosives or drugs. Instead, these special detectives are trying to stop pests and agricultural diseases from getting into the country. Chris Van Cleve goes on patrol. Goo. You're watching the hunt for dangers hidden inside airline baggage. What you got, Jasper? Leading this search, a six-year-old rescue beagle named Jasper, who's trained to find prohibited food and agriculture that could be lurking in the luggage of international travelers. There it is. We have fruits. All right, I need your passport and customs form, ma'am. Customs agriculture specialist Amanda Triple is Jasper's partner. Oh, we actually have found a whale blubber. That, that was odd. Our job is to protect American agriculture. We're concerned about insects, diseases, and pests that could be on those different fruits, vegetables, and meats. All of this was found in bags coming into a terminal at New York's JFK airport in just a few hours. Any of these things could be carrying something that's hazardous? Absolutely. They could be carrying pests that we don't have in the United States that could ha cause great harm to our agriculture. The danger is real. Customs officials say a traveler brought the African large land snail to Florida, a pest that devours everything from valuable citrus crops to stucco on homes. Some things are concealed. They'll conceal things and wrap it up, and there's no way of seeing it on the x-ray machine. Find it. Making Jasper and the more than 150 other agriculture canines patrolling U.S. airports. There it is. The apples. All right, good boy. A four-legged last line of defense. Chris Van Cleve, CBS News, New York. Yes. I didn't know so many people tried to smuggle in food. Like but that's why beagles Beag are awesome. <laughs> yeah. I Just might another have reason that story. for you to brag. Yeah. Bags that Jasper sniffs out are flagged for further inspection. Not declaring prohibited agriculture to U.S. Customs can result in fines that start at 175 bucks.